This morning, an attorney representing the physician's assistant involved in a dispute over city bike says his client's safety is in danger. It follows the posting of a now viral video involving her and a young man who says he also reserved that same bike. CBS 2's Christy Collegian joins us live from the newsroom with more. Christy? Good morning, ladies. The attorney says his client has been getting threats that people are showing up outside her house, adding that someone even sent her a picture of her front door saying, I'm here for you. But he persists that his client was not targeting the young black man in the video for his race and that she reserved that bike first. In a video that's since gone viral, Sarah Jane Comrie and a young black man are claiming the same city bike after Comrie's 12-hour shift as a physician's assistant at Bellevue Hospital last Friday. Justin Marino, who represents Comrie, points to receipts that show she was the one who paid for the bike reservation. Do you think any pregnant woman in their right mind would jump on another young man's bike and like just scoot away while they're six months pregnant. But since the video was shared on Twitter by civil rights attorney Ben Crump, many believe race was at play here. Crump tweeted Sunday, this is unacceptable, accusing Comrie of trying to steal the bike, saying this is exactly the type of behavior that has endangered so many black men in the past. Bellevue Hospital has since responded, describing the confrontation as disturbing, saying Comrie is on leave now as an investigation continues, saying as for its patients and employees, it's, quote, providing an environment for our patients and staff that is free from discrimination of any kind. Marino's goal is to set the record straight, saying that she, in fact, did pay for the bike, while also addressing newly added safety concerns for his client. She's been threatened. People have been outside the house. She, she's had someone send her a picture of her front door saying, I'm here for you. And the video has since gotten thousands of retweets since it was posted Sunday. And when looking at the tweet now, you can see that Twitter adds links to reports citing that Comrie did pay for the city bike. In the newsroom, Christy Kalishian, CBS 2 News. All right, Christy, thank you so much.